Hey, it's your boy Bobby Beast here. I want to talk about a subject that comes to mind, and that is who is Effie running from? When it comes down to it, I didn't even know that was Effie in the trailer. When they were talking about, um, is Lauren safe? Right. You uh, you think that, OK, that must be Lauren running, but that's not Lauren. That's Effie. I had to take time to really look at it because the scene is very dark. But upon taking my time to look at it, you can see real closely that that is Effie's face looking as if she's running and she's worried about something. Just exactly what it is. I have no idea. But what kind of trouble could Effie be in? Remember, Effie is a person that we don't know too much about. So then there's like a, there's stuff we don't know about her. Like when it comes down to it, she Let's be for real. She is the most um, mysterious power character that we have currently going, like in terms of not knowing too much about her. And what I mean by that is basically Effie goes back to season six of Power and she comes into book one, well, book two Ghosts and book um, season one and season two. And we still don't know too much about her. We just know enough. Tyree deals with her. He to some degree trusts her. Shouldn't because at the same time, she's an opponent. She's trustworthy. She is the Selena Kyle, aka the Catwoman. Um, and what I mean like that, well, to Tyreek, because basically when it comes down to it, with Batman, not to bring in Batman, but this is just the truth. Ty it's like with Batman, Batman loves Selena Kyle. He loves Catwoman, but he can't really trust her, meaning that even though he's a superhero, he can't really change her because she still wants to be a thief. She still wants to be a burglar, but she does what she does and she does, she does her own thing. And so Batman doesn't really mess with her. So that's the thing with Tariq. Tariq and Effie get along with each other. They do love each other, but it's a situation where she's going to do whatever she wants to do. And, and Tariq knows he can't really like, like he cannot really truly trust her because at the same time, she's an opponent and she will choose business over him if she has to she she said it was a hard decision to make but she will choose business over him but will Tariq choose business over Effie I don't know that's a tough one because it seems like to me when Tariq cares about somebody he does care about them a lot and especially with him being down Effie was there for him immediately and even though there may be agenda there he still looks at it like okay you came through when nobody else did so when it comes down to it with Effie, again, we don't know too much about her. She's running. We don't know why she's running. It could be anything. It could be a situation. But with stuff going down, who's to say? As a matter of fact, for all we know, um, it probably not even a big situation. But with that look on her face, it does not seem like it's something that we can just push to the side. It seems like there is something that's going on. So we'll just have to see um, how this pretty much um, plays out with Effie. I hope everything is okay with her. Of course, as far as I'm aware, she's going to end up in season three because Courtney did say we're going to get more of her backstory in season three. So apparently she's not going anywhere. But um, but but just because she's not going anywhere does not mean that she might not be in a dangerous situation. So we will have to find out, you know, um, what's what's going on when it comes down to that. But I just want to say to all of you that it's your boy Bobby Beast here, um, and I just want to say um, much love, much respect, hold it down, and one. It's your boy Bobby Beast here. Okay. Understand something. There are going to be people out there that's trying to mislead you and try to hurt you no matter what. And there's going to be people who are either going to stand by you or they're going to let you fall. Trust you. Believe in your strength and believe in who you believe in.